So a foundation, a, an individual can actually give away 50% of their money. Now, let, let's just face it right now. This is, this is money that would have been taxed. This is, we're all the way down to the AGI, the adjusted gross income that tax is applied to. So when they take that 30% and gift it to their own foundation, they just took their AGI down by 30%, guys. So that's serious. Now, when I said, but wait, there's more, they can actually write off 50% because another 20% could go to what's called a public foundation, meaning that it's not personally controlled, that there's other foundations out there that are public foundations that, that, that do work with the public. And that other 20% could be donated to a public foundation or they could become a public foundation. So in other words, 50% of the income goes over to the foundation each and every year. And, but wait, there's more. That foundation can actually partner with your own trust. So in other words, if you created a foundation, then it could be a partner in a project that you're doing yourself. So that means you even have more control over your money that uh, is inside that foundation. And the foundation can pay for interesting things too. Foundation can pay, for example, for your house. No, no, it's not your house. The foundation would own the house and would require you to live there. And by the way, it's unlike other tax code areas where a foundation you actually have no personal use, meaning the foundation owns it, you can use it, and there's absolutely no charge for you as the trustee of the foundation to use that property. So there's some really cool things that can happen with a foundation. And uh, so I just wanted to give you a little bit of education on that because Xavier, as you continue, and Tracy, as you continue on your mission and what you're doing to cause things to happen in your world, open that door wider to all those businesses that are right there in your communities that have piles of money that may already have foundations. I have found CPA firms that have foundations. I've found attorneys that have foundations. I've found doctors that have foundations. I've found businesses that have foundations. So it's not hard to find these folks. And, uh, you know, they advertise if they're a public foundation, they're, they're advertising out there doing <clears throat> things. You can even see, you know, when you go to the opera or you go to plays, you know, you can see that they have got sponsorships from foundations. Well, I, you can bet that there's a tie-in with the personal use there. <laughs> they, they're getting a free ride in some form or fashion to be part of that. And not to mention that when you go to the club, it makes you look really good when you're when you've got a foundation and you're giving away things and doing things. So we just want to open a door to these foundations. Now you can say, well, Lou, that's a great new idea that you have. Well, it's not a new idea. It's in your house monster. I have a letter in your house monster that is already written to connect with those foundations. 